Hi, in this video, I summarize my project on hard modularization, which is an improved modularization strategy for multitask reinforcement learning. Multitask RL is basically training a single network on multiple tasks. Sharing common network allows to reuse and utilize common structures across different tasks. We use the meta world as a roboting manipulation benchmark to test our algorithm on. There are various approaches to multitask RL, and I have chosen the modularization approach. And you can visit this link for reference, and I have built on the soft modularization approach proposed here. So here's my method called hard modularization. We have broken down the agent's network, that is both the Q network and the policy network, into smaller blocks or modules. And we train a selection network, which takes in task index and the observation to compute two things. One is a set of weights with which to combine the outputs from the different modules, and also a binary mask, which selects which modules to use. This is a hard binary selection, which gives hard modularization its name. And only the modules that are selected are used in the forward inference. The module outputs are weighted and added up before being passed on to the next layer. So here's the training results for training for 10 million steps using soft actor critic algorithm. And we have reached a similar success rate to that of soft modularization baseline. And here are the success rates for 10 tasks. So here's the video of the trained agent performing the meta world tasks. We see that the last layer weights are changing smoothly with time, and the lower layers are chosen differently for different tasks. Up to two modules are used per task, so we could draw away modules that are not used to save space and inference time. So on the right is a breakdown of computational time for each stage. And in the final row, the main network forward time is saved up to 57% for hard modularization. And also the effective net size for each task is decreased as shown in the gray color on the chart to the left. However, we use a sparse max operation to specify the weights which gives additional computation, so the total inference time is actually marginally worse. So, in conclusion, I have designed a new hard selection approach to multitask learning. Hard modularization allows to draw away unused modules and also save main network forward time. For more information on the project, you can visit the project GitHub. Thank you.